Hey guys, welcome back to the Old Phone channel. Have you ever needed to remove an Apple account from your iPhone? Maybe you're selling it, upgrading, or you simply forgot your Apple ID password. Don't worry today, I will show you four reliable methods that cover various models and iOS versions to successfully unlock your iPhone. Important notice. Bypassing activation lock on a device you don't own without permission is illegal. This video is for educational purposes only. Method 1. Change the password on the iForgot website. If you forgot your Apple ID password or just want to change it, I'm going to show you super easy steps to do it on the official site, iForgot.com. Let's get started. Open your browser and go to iForgot.com. That's Apple's official page for resetting your password. Enter your Apple ID email, then click continue. And now Apple's going to ask you to verify your identity. Enter your phone number that you use with Apple ID. Check your phone for the verification code Apple sends via SMS or notification. Type the code you got into the box on the website, then click continue. What if you don't get the code? You can click don't have access to your phone to address. Once your phone is successfully verified, you can reset a password to unlock your phone. If you forget your phone number or other information, let's move on to the next step. Method 2. Ask the original owner to remove iCloud lock. This is the easiest and most official way. Perfect if you can contact the original owner. First, ask the original owner to visit iCloud.com find on a computer or another phone and log into their Apple account. Next, they should locate the lock device in the list. Then, select Remove this device and follow the on-screen instructions. Once done, go back to your iPhone, restart the setup process, and the activation lock will be gone. Now you can set up your iPhone as a new device. This method is fully supported by Apple and keeps all iCloud features intact, but it only works if you can reach the original owner. Method 3. Unlock via IME iRemote service. If you can't contact the original owner, you might be able to unlock the phone using its IMEI number. On the lock screen, tap the exclamation mark icon in the bottom corner to view your IMEI. Then contact your carrier or a reputable unlocking website that offers IMEI-based services. Submit your IMEI and wait for the verification and processing. However, this usually takes five days or even two weeks for review. So if you don't want to wait that long, you can try the next method. Method 4. Unlock using Alt Phone Activation Unlocker. If you forgot your Apple account, this tool can remove the activation lock directly. It also works on all kinds of iPads and can unlock them within two hours. Highly recommend it. Download Alt Phone from the link in the video description and install it on your computer. First, launch the Alt Phone. Click Start to Remove. Read and accept the cautions carefully. Click on the Start to proceed. Connect your locked iPhone to your computer with cable. As soon as the software detects your device, it will begin downloading the jailbreak tool automatically. Once it's done, plug in a blank USB drive. Select it in the software and click Start to burn the jailbreak environment. Follow the prompts to restart your computer. While your computer restarts, press F12 to enter the boot menu. Then select your USB storage device and press Enter. In Jailbreak Wizard, go to Options and enable Allow Untested iOS and skip all BPR check. Go back and click Start, then Next. Your device will enter Recovery Mode. Click Start and follow on. Screen steps to enter DFU mode. Quickly press Volume Down buttons, then hold the Side button. When the screen go black, after about 2 to 4 seconds, off the Side button and continue holding the Volume Down button. If the Apple logo appears on the phone, please restart this process. But if the screen says black, it is actually in DFU mode. Once DFU mode is detected, the jailbreak will start automatically. Keep your iPhone connected until it's done. After the jailbreak completes, it's time to remove the activation lock for good. Boot your PC back into Windows. Open Alt Phone Activation Unlocker again. Click Start to remove. Confirm your device info and hit Start. Wait for the process to finish, and that's it. The activation lock is gone. Now you can set up your iPhone like new and sign in with a new Apple ID from the App Store. However, please note that this supports removal only on the premise that your phone is an iPhone 5 to X and the system is iOS 12 to 16. 
If your model meets the requirements, you can use Alt Phone Activation Unlock to unlock it. And after successful unlocking, you won't have to face the activation lock at all if you want to remove the Apple account from your phone. And there you have it, you've bypassed activation lock without needing your old Apple ID or password. If this helped you, drop a like, share it with a friend, and subscribe for more iOS tips. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.